All right, so here we go. When you get one like this and it wants to know which form is equivalent, now I know we haven't got to factoring yet. It doesn't even matter because you know how to use a calculator. We're going to go to y equals. Let me zoom this in. All right, and we're going to plug in that first one. We're going to put in x squared. Oh, no, we're not. Hold on. We're going to go to y equals. x squared minus 17x minus 60. Okay, so we want to know which of these matches it. So we go down to the one below it, and we put in parenthesis x minus 20, parenthesis x plus 3. You're going to go to second and table, and we're going to see if they match. Oh, looky there. What do you notice? Yeah, they both match. So that means A is the equivalent. Let me just show you so you can see what it would look like if it didn't match. If I put in the second one, X, maybe you're one of those people, you like to check them all just to be sure. X minus 12. Second table. And look how they don't match. The tables are not the same. Okay. So, but on A, the tables did match.